From a shocking video of a mysterious whirlpool swallowing everything in its path and eventually draining an entire three-acre swamp, to the incredible moment the opening of a dam spillway created a powerful vortex capable of sucking down a full-sized boat. Here are 10 minutes of incredible whirlpool videos. Located in the western highlands of the Kenyan Rift Valley is the city of Kericho. Back on May 1st of 2020, locals here were going about their day when they noticed the water in a small pond start to move. Upon closer inspection, they noticed some sort of sinkhole had formed underneath the body of water, and a whirlpool had taken shape. Intrigued, they took out their phones and started filming capturing the exact moment it began to swallow everything in its path. In the end, locals reported that the whirlpool and sinkhole ended up swallowing an estimated three acres of swampland. Aside from that, not much more is known about the cause of this strange phenomenon. But it sure is pretty cool and kind of terrifying seeing everything being swallowed up like that. One question that still remains is, where did all the debris go? Well, perhaps this next video will answer that. On October 18th of 2021, a couple watching the tides in an Oregon bay discovered that a mysterious whirlpool was forming right before their eyes. After a few minutes, the couple had a curious idea to see what would happen if they threw something into it, and the result was just as incredible as you might imagine. Get it. Horrible throw. It's all right. It might float into it. Uh, just barely. No, here it comes again. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. It's, oh, oh, back down again. Comes again. No. Oh, that time it might have gone all the way. Do you think it took it down? No, it's right there again. Oh, coming it's, back up. It's hanging out about. No. No, I think it's gone now. Oh, I took it down. Let's go over to the other side and see if we have a pumpkin up coming up. No way. That would be so awesome. There it is! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> The pumpkin struggled for a while at first, but eventually was sucked down below the surface. It then traveled underneath the road they were standing on and out the other side. According to the couple, the whirlpool was caused by two big culvert pipes which go under the road. In fact, you can actually find this whirlpool yourself from time to time, depending on the tides. In terms of size, though, this whirlpool was definitely on the smaller side. Something that probably cannot be said about this next video. Denison Dam, also known as Lake Texoma Dam, is located on the Red River between Texas and Oklahoma and is used to control flooding, regulate river levels, and produce hydroelectric power. Back in 2015, Lake Texoma had reached levels that officials deemed to be too high, and something had to be done. 
After some back and forth, a decision was made to release some of the water and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers was called in. But upon opening the spillways, an interesting and powerful whirlpool vortex immediately took shape, and it threatened the safety of those boating on the lake. Exclusive footage taken in June of that year shows the full size of the whirlpool, estimated to be approximately 8 feet in diameter, with enough power to suck down a full-sized boat with ease. Thankfully, officials released a statement warning boaters of the danger and urging them to stay away. Buoys and caution signs were also placed nearby. After a couple of months, the waters had subsided to an acceptable height and the spillways were closed. If you live in the area, keep an eye on the news because the next time the lake needs to be lowered, you might be able to witness this incredible whirlpool for yourself. Between the Canadian provinces of Ontario and Quebec lies the Ottawa River, a perfect place for boating and water sports. Back on November 14th of 2016, three friends ventured to the river with their kayaks for what should have been a full day of fun. At some point, the group noticed that in a particular spot, the water created a small whirlpool, and for whatever reason, they decided to try and get sucked in. Unfortunately, the power of the vortex was a bit greater than they expected, and their fun day nearly took a dark turn when one of them was flipped over and nearly pulled beneath the surface. Oh, Alright, go nice and high near near Tom, you gotta get one. I want you guys in the same frame. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Despite the laughter by the man filming, it's clear from watching the video that this could have ended very badly. Each time the kayaker who was stuck tried to flip over, the vortex quickly sucked him back in. It goes to show you the unsuspecting power even the smallest of whirlpools can have. Thankfully, his friends were nearby to help, and in the end, he escaped completely uninjured. By now, it should be clear that whirlpools come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. Similarly, they are caused by a variety of factors. Many are naturally occurring, while others are man-made. You get the idea. In the southeastern region of England lies the county of East Sussex. Back in late December of 2018, the area experienced days of heavy rain which flooded streets and property. After the storm passed, a local man went out to inspect the damage and noticed a culvert pipe on his property was blocked by debris and a small pond had formed. Using a shovel, he worked hard to solve the problem, scooping leaves and dirt away from the pipe, allowing water to flow in. Watch as a small whirlpool forms and all the trapped water quickly drains from the landscape.
All it took was a few minutes of work for the pipe to be cleared and all that flood water to drain. According to the man, the culvert was built back in 2007 with the singular purpose of preventing the forest from turning into swampland. While the whirlpool in this video wasn't a particularly big one, the way the water drained so easily was definitely satisfying to watch. Well, that about wraps things up for this video. If you enjoyed it and want to see more just like it, be sure to click the link on screen now. With that said, thank you all for watching, and be sure to tune in next time.